Wait, what's the plumber friend do? Right, I'm just recently re-looking into some of my kits, and um, yeah, this is a big one. That's my soul. I've done. I did a video on this in 2017, so it's 2021 now. I thought some of you guys might not have seen that video. So basically, I don't. In my opinion, I don't understand how people can re-stock and mount a pile stock of soul, but never put salt in their inch packs. That's a bit what always confused me. That's all a bit what always baffled me. I just didn't understand it. And I used to carry, I used to carry salt in those small oil bags. And I basically found out one time that if you put something stupidly heavy beside it, it goes pop, and all the salt goes everywhere inside my rucksack. It went everywhere inside my rucksack. It took me three, four days to shake out that salt to get rid of all the salt from inside the rucksack. And then it got into one of my zips and it just didn't do very well to the zip, put it that way. So I had to upgrade it, I had to change it, and I had to basically think all over again on how I'm going to carry the salt because to me personally salt's important because you can salt your food like if I catch a squirrel or catch a or catch a fish I shouldn't say one or two I should say multiple fish at a time or multiple squirrels at a time say for example I don't want to just I don't want to kill for killing sake I want to kill for something I want to kill so basically if I had to hunt i want to hunt properly i don't want to go along and go oh there's a squirrel there oh i killed that one but let's just leave it on the ground no i don't want to do that that's just not me full stop never will be me even in a survival situation that would never be me because food will be so scarce more so then than what it is now so i like to carry salt i changed my salt from then i put it now in one of these pocket organizers i have a few of these and um they were cheap at the time, they were less than three pounds, now they're up to a fiver for the Chinese copy. So it's up to do with you if you copy if you get these, I'm just probably warning you. They are gone up in price a lot. So yeah, but it's not up to do with the pouch. It's to do with the content inside. This is what I call my salt, and I might be putting my fiber carbonate of soda in this one pouch in this pouch as well, because it's, as you know it's two sided. So, I'll show you, quickly, see, there's the other side, that's the side of my, my bicarbonate solder, this is my salt side, I have got a label that says salt on it, and I have 20 of these small straws like this, they're not small, they're the um, milkshake straws, but I know that there will be enough to say to salt a lot um, to basically put salt on a rabbit to dry it um to turn it into jerky. I know that's enough there. For the biggest thing I'm gonna catch. I know that. I I was I'm a chef by trade. So I know how I'm I've worked out so many times, I've done this so many times for my own research. I advise you to do your research, don't just copy me. But yeah, I've got that and it's lovely to have and I recommend it to recommend it. So yeah, it's things like that. So I have twenty of these, and so yeah, let's see what you carry in your rucksack. My stock logs, wise. I'm um, sorry this video went on a bit longer than what it should have. I do apologise about that. It's just that I think personally this is one of the most important pieces of equipment. So thank you very much for watching, and we'll see you soon. Bye for now. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And we'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.